What's up guys, it's Saturday, August 22nd. It's 7 a.m. I got my smoothie, you know what time it is. It's ready to go, let's make some flips. But first off, I'm gonna give you a recap of what has happened in the past couple of weeks with what we've bought and what we've sold. A not so great flip and what we're still holding on to is the $10 I spent for a backpack and a couple of shelves, plastic shelves, and some poker chips. Haven't sold any of that stuff yet, but it is the beginning of the school year, so hopefully someone will come by it. I think they will. It is Arizona, and we got ASU right around the corner. Another great flip was the garden planter box that we rehabbed. I kind of screwed it back into place and gave it a wood shine. That sold from 15 to 65. Now, it wasn't the 120 that I thought I was gonna get, but still it was a solid flip for minimal effort. Also, what we had the previous week was some patio table adventures. Now, I'll start with the first patio table that we bought. It was in shambles, it was the green one. I bought some spray paint and an umbrella holder. I cleaned it up and then I bought another patio set to get a set of cushions. All told, both of those patio sets cost me $200 altogether. $150 for one, $50 for the shitty one. I posted both with the set of cushions. Whichever sold first was going to get the cushions. As luck would have it, the second set sold immediately with the cushions. So I was back to square one with no cushions, but I still made $70 off of that. I sold it for $220. So the first patio set, still in shambles, finally sold yesterday with no cushions for $100. And by the way, I also sold that two set of cushions that it came with after I hosed it down for 20 bucks. So all told, I made $70 profit on both sets of patio cushions. So that was good, $140 profit there. The previous week I had another patio set that I came up on. That one sold day of from 50 to $250. So that was a great flip. I knew it when I had it because it was brand new and looking great and totally undervalued. I'm still holding on to the heater that I got, the tall heater. That was another $50 investment, but that could be big money. And I'm waiting for winter time to sell that and I still need to fix it up a little bit. But all told, it was a great couple weeks, a lot of money in the pocket. And now we got some money to go for this next day of flips. So let's go, we're gonna attach a trailer, hop in the truck and get out there. Here up. We're ready to go. Hi there. Guitar Hero. Legendary. Mm -hmm. Legends of Rock. How much are the games? Um, I was thinking like... Three bucks for one. Okay. And then I'm like, oh, I could like do two for five. Sure. Yeah. A bunch of clothes and a few old hats, some furniture, um, I guess as well, chairs. A mask. Um, how much do you want for this chair? Um, hundred bucks. Hundred bucks, wow. But it's just you know super nice chair. It's all in good condition, and I don't know what do you what do you what were you thinking? I was thinking like twenty bucks. <laughs> you gotta do thirty. Thirty bucks for it. Um, I'll do twenty five. Okay. Yeah, give yeah, me yeah. A sec. I, sure. I'm gonna pay. I got cash. And then you said you had a desk. Yes. Um, if you want, pop inside. Yeah, yeah, sure. I I'll take a look. So this is the desk. That's for sale. Okay. Um, Burn mark. It's an IKEA desk. How much do you want for it? Thirty bucks. Thirty bucks. The desk I can sell for you for twenty-five. And the games, I'll throw the games in for twenty-five. The desk. Yeah, I'll do all for fifty. The chair. Mm -hmm. I can't do that chair for that last. So that okay. What What do you want to do for it? The chair. Well, all of it. All of it. The chair for fifty, and then the desk for twenty, and the games included. So I, I'd do sixty for all of it. Is it just sixty-five. Sure. Okay. Cool. Okay, you got the chum on it? Yeah. Dude, same. Here's 60. Five. Five. There you go. Ow. This thing is fing painful. <laughs> Thank you.
Great first garage sale of the day. The first item that I saw was a couple of games and wasn't necessarily sure what the games are gonna be worth, but he was asking for three bucks, so we'll probably make a few dollars with that. But then when I looked over and I saw that he had a computer chair, that thing was in mint condition. He wanted a hundred, I negged it. 20 bucks because I'm not trying to spend hundred dollars on a computer chair. We negotiated, his roommate got involved. I ended up taking his desk, computer chair, and three games for 65 bucks. So I think I'll be able to flip that for at least 150. We'll see though. Sign, pretty legit. Hi there, how's it going? Hey, it's low, you know these people send them our way. Yeah, you got some, uh, are these mats, yeah, like camp camp mats. camping mats? Oh, this is interesting. Uh -huh. Some toys. They got an old school radio flyer. How much do you want for this? Uh, give me a number. You know, I, ha I actually have no idea because I've never bought or sold one of these before. What do you want for it? Uh, 20. 20 bucks? Yeah. Yeah, it's a little out of my price range. So, would you do the uh, the trike and the radio flyer for 20? Uh, yeah. Which one? The tricycle and the radio flyer? Yeah. Yeah? Sure. Okay. Yeah. Here you go. Do you guys have like a garbage or something? There's some trash in here. Cool, so the last garage sale, I went and saw the radio flyer wagon. You know, I don't know much about it, so I came back to the car, I looked it up. Uh, it's selling for like 65 on offer up. The dude wanted 20 for it, so I went back and I tried to add value to the deal by throwing in a tricycle, which was kind of valued at like 20 bucks. And he said, yeah, so $80 worth of value there for 20 bucks, pretty good. But when I brought the, the tricycle back, there's like crayons and like crayons like melted into the bottom of it that I didn't notice. You know, these are the things that you have to look for before you purchase because again, there's no refunds. We'll see if I can resuscitate the uh, tricycle. I'm sure I'll make my money back and then some, but we'll see. Hi there. Is that the old mattress? Yeah. Yeah. Got a little Keurig action, cool. Are you selling the patio table? This one back here? Okay. Yeesh. Some lamps. And then some other stuff over there. Just this stuff? Gotcha. Wonder if this thing works. <laughs> Do some pull-ups. Broken. And I've sold these before, but this one is too f***ed up. Maybe if I tighten the screws. How much you want for this? Three. Three bucks. I I might have two bucks. Four. Yeah. Alrighty. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, appreciate it. Got the shitty pull-up bar. Very shitty, but uh, two bucks can turn this into 20. Just tighten up the screws and that's what I'll do. Good morning. Got a little ottoman. Some more video games, huh? How's your sale been so far? Yeah? I made about 50 bucks. Nice, man. Is this Battlefront 1 or? This is the first one, yeah. Would you do the, the hoop Battlefront in this ottoman for 15 bucks? Let's do 20. 20 bucks for it all? Sure. Um, okay. There you go. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. Oh, it's lighter than I thought. Cool.
Hi there. Earth fizzlet? What on earth is an earth fizzlet? Some power rangers? Hi. Hi there. Could you do 10 bucks for this box? I could sell you mine for $2 a piece. How's that sound? When you smash them, there's a surprise that comes out the back. Right? And the kids like that, right? You know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna find them in the dollar store. <laughs> Would you do uh, 12 bucks? That's fine. You got okay. it. Take it. Here you go. All right, got some toys. All right, looks like we got something going on here. Looks like a desk and a doggy door are free. Let's check it out. Maybe we're worth taking a chance on, I don't know. Yeah, why not? All right, well that was the, I guess the final sale of the day. It wasn't even a sale though, because we stopped on the side of the street and someone was throwing out a desk and a uh, doggy door. So we just picked that baby right up and we'll sell it for pure profit, which is pretty cool. But overall, a pretty solid day. You know, went to uh, a lot of garage sales. A decent amount of them, we didn't even get anything, but you know, that's kind of the way it is. You gotta look for the best deal. We'll get back to the house right now and see what we got. All right guys, so just got back from our garage sale adventures today. Day. First sale of the day, got this awesome computer chair and this IKEA desk along with four video games for Xbox 360 for 65 bucks. Now, I think that's the biggest win of the day. Probably will flip that for anywhere from $150 to $200 for all the items. Next sale, I got this wagon and this tricycle here for 20 bucks. Unfortunately, the tricycle is fucking disgusting with uh, some melted crayons in there. So I'm not sure I'm gonna sell this at all, but I'll probably sell this for somewhere around 60. Another sale, I got this large ottoman, this basketball hoop, and another video game for Xbox One for 20 bucks. Now, probably we'll be able to flip all of that for somewhere around 60 to $70. Next sale, I got this box of brand new toys. I believe they're called Smash Crashers. These are small ticket items. You could sell those on eBay. I bought them for 12 bucks, I believe, and could potentially flip total for 30, 40. And then a final bonus item, I got this blue desk and a doggy door insert for free. Someone posted them on the side of the road for literally nothing. And I might be able to make uh, 40 bucks out of that. So that's it for our garage sale adventure today. Please like and subscribe for our next video, which will be an update on what I actually sold all these things for and how long it took me. And once again, I'm Flipman Dan. Thanks for joining us.